Hey everybody, it's Alma. Welcome back to Keto Meets Menopause. <laughs> Everybody, it's Alma. So by the time you see this video, it's going to be June 1st, which means day one of our June challenge where we eliminate the majority of our sugar alcohols and our artificial sweeteners. All of those. Yeah, it's true. So guys, are you excited? I am. I can't wait to find out what's going to happen in a month's time to see if my scale moves a little bit, if my overall health increases, if my energy level gets better, and just overall health. So guys, Here's what I'm going to suggest that you do. Number one, make sure you weigh yourself. Weigh, 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 weigh. I don't care if you don't ever weigh. Weigh today, weigh at the end of the month. All right? So number one, we're going to go ahead and weigh ourselves. Number two, measure. At least measure your neck, your chest, your hips, and your waist. A tip on the waist is put your finger at your belly button and measure there. That's what all the clinics do. Number three. If you're up for it, take pictures, all right? And don't just do body pictures, all right? Get a close-up of your face. Let's see what happens to our complexion. Does it look less ruddy? Does it look a little younger? Does it feel brighter? All right, take a picture of your face, not just the body. All right, if you're looking for support, join our Facebook group. We are a really small group, and so it's gonna be very intimate. It's not gonna be a situation where there's 20,000 uh, members and your voice doesn't really get heard. So I am liking that it's a very intimate little group. So come on in, there'll be a link in the description, all right? Get rid of any items in your house that are items of temptation. If you've got Tarani, if you've got Skinny Girl, if you've got um, the Dollar Tree, <laughs> which is what I use on occasion, get rid of them. If you have any foods that create anxiety, any drinks that are gonna create anxiety for you during this time period, move it, get it out of your pantry, put it in your closet. You know, I'm not telling you that you can never use these things again. And let me tell you, I would never do that to you guys. I don't wanna look at anybody's journey as a bad thing. Everybody finds their way to their perfect keto. And that's where I am right now, looking to find my perfect keto. So taking it back to the basics, hopefully you will too, and hopefully we'll all find a great place. And if not, you gave it a try guys. When someone says, oh, if you just get rid of artificial sweeteners, you'd be better. Hey, if nothing gets better, you'll know that's the answer. I did share this on a video last night, but I'm already virtually three weeks without coffee. It may be, it may actually be three weeks. I lose count. Time, time escapes me these days. But I had coffee twice. I had it once at IHOP, and I ate clean there, guys. My gym? I've had it at my gym. And I think the second time was at my gym. Both times, immediately upon drinking, hot flash. And that happens because it's a hot drink and also the caffeine. So if you're if you're up for it, give up your coffee, guys. If you're not going to enjoy the coffee because it doesn't have your artificial sweetener of choice and it because it doesn't have your Tarani or your skinny syrup or whatever it is that you're using, give it up. It's summer. Who needs it in the summer? I prefer my coffee in the wintertime. So it really was not a huge issue for me to go ahead and say bye-bye for the next 30 days. And, in regards to coffee. And I really didn't get the headaches either. I was really surprised that that didn't happen. So guys, seriously, don't think that you can't do this challenge. It's just a month. Even if you have to say week one, Alma, I'm gonna give up one thing. Week two, another thing. Week three, another thing. And perhaps week four, you'll be done. And you can start a new month of July with all of them out of your system and see how that goes. So yeah, guys. Uh, join our Facebook group, get your measurements, take pictures, get a picture of your beautiful face, and uh, let's start this journey, all right? I look forward to following your journey, sharing my journey, and I uh, can't wait to see where we end on July 1st. Oh, my birthday, 52, July 1st. Anyways, that's besides the point. <laughs> how, will I celebrate my, how will I celebrate my 52nd birthday? <laughs> Maybe it's some gold peak. I'm just kidding, guys. I'm just kidding. All right, guys. I look forward to talking to you soon. Have a blessed day. Bye-bye. Thank you so much for allowing me to spend time with you. If you haven't already done so, please hit the like button, subscribe to my channel, and hit that notification button. So that you'll know each time I post a new video. All right, guys. Have a great day. Bye-bye. Choice Wednesday. It's Onito. Now here's my wife to teach us keto. Pork rinds, pork rinds, rah, rah, rah. Carbohydrates, carbohydrates, blah, blah, blah.